Well, all smiles here by Alderman Haswell. Nice to have him on track. Uh, he supports Natty Cotson. These are his colours. Well done to the breeders, Mr. and Mrs. Proctor, also good friends of Natty Cotson, uh, son of Just as well. Just for the penny, just for the penny has come through giving Muzi any races one and two. And uh, last time out, or should I say the, the debut, Nathan, uh, your horse, we know how good he is, uh, Cadence Pride. We'll see him over the weekend. Uh, but this horse debuted against him against winners? Yeah, he was drawn wide that day. We actually threw him in the deep end, you know. He was very, very green. He didn't know what he was doing. He actually wasn't 100% fit as well. Um, but it brought him on nicely, you know. And um, I've done more work at home, home with him. And um, today I said to Rob, you know, Rob, all we've got against us is a draw. I said, I'm not worried about anything else. I said, his work's been very good. Rob actually came up in the weekend, seen him work. And... Um, yeah, it's, I just thought yeah, the door was a bit of a, a worry, and uh, he didn't actually come out that well. He like really fell out, and I thought, oh, we're in trouble. He's near the back, but he ran on very nicely. And um, just, yeah, Muzi said they went very fast, fast, which suited him. Just thanks to um, Anton Proctor and to, to Judy. I mean, uh, he better. He always said, um, Anton, he said it's going to be a nice horse. And he, um, I'll be, hopefully, he's just going to go on from here. You know, horses tend to do funny things, but hopefully, he goes on from here. Stables uh, having a good end to the season, Natty. Yeah, I am. I've done well, actually. I've been done too bad. Thank you. Before you leave, anything else from your side? Well, I've got the one in the next race. It is odds on. Hopefully, I'll go close. Um, then I've got uh, Cumulus, obviously, a trial, big art. And then after some, you can have a rest. Before you leave us, a lot of followers of Caden Sprite. How's he doing back home for the weekend? Caden's very well. Um, also, 1600 is going to suit him. Last time, he didn't get the best of breaks. Hopefully, breaks well and um, we get a bit of luck in running. I know it's a very, very strong field. We'll see how good it is uh, on Saturday. Thanks for that, Natty. Keep up the good work, my man. Well done to your team. Thank you and just a big thanks to Rob for all the support. You know, he's, he's bought me a couple of horses and um, his son's also got involved a bit. Um, thanks very much. Well done. Thank you. Lovely. Muzi, any? He's not yet. Sorry, and to Muzi as well. Thanks very much. You know, he's a good mate of mine and great ride. Thank you. Fantastic. Let's get the alderman in, Rob Haswell. Rob, the last time you spoke, uh, all joy, all pleasure. Yeah. And uh, this one must give you the same feeling. Yeah, look, this is a very special, emotional win for me. The horse is named after my late wife. I'm very pleased. Some of her best friends, Wendy, Philida, whose birthday it is today, Lynn's here. So they're all here to celebrate this. And, of course, I had a good punt on the horse. I've seen her, him work. And uh, I knew he was well above average colt. That debut against winners doesn't tell a true story. No, no. As, as Nathan said, he was, he was all at sea on that particular day. But we've seen him working with the quality horses that uh, Nathan's got in his yard. It's a big, strong horse, just as well. So we waited. We waited for a 14, 1600. And the result is now clear. I love it. I love it. I'll tell you why. Because we all uh, try and find... You know, there's Christmas gifts throughout the year, and it seems like this was yours at around 35. What price did you get? 60 to 1. Woo! Mommy, 60 to 1. And Beautiful I, thing. I, I don't want to say too much. I've got even bigger doubles into Cumulus. So if Cumulus wins, well, somebody else will have to stand here. Well, if Cumulus wins, I think whichever bookmaker you had this bet with, he needs to have the helicopter ready to take him to the emergency room. Intensive care. Yeah. Intensive care. <laughs> I love it, my man. Nice setting to you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Big thanks to Nathan. Uh, he's been very patient with this horse. Anton uh, and Judy. You know, I've watched this horse grow up. Yes. I've been watching this horse for the best part of 18 months now. Yeah. So I know the horse inside out. And uh, again... Muzi, this win might have, might have come just a bit too late for the championship, but you've had an incredible year. Sharp. Well done, Rob. Lovely. Lovely words. 60 to 1. There's a bit of pressure on Cumulus now. Some heavy doubles running into that, but that's uh, the man for the job is uh, the dynamite who comes in small packages, our good friend Muzi. Talk us through it. Uh, well, uh, Nathan sounded quite confident, obviously. He had his concerns with the draw, but he said Muzi is putting up very, very good work. When I spoke to him in the ring and he said to me, expecting a big run. Obviously, still an immature horse, but uh, he thinks it's quite a nice horse. And I broke out to try be, to try place him from the draw. And uh, he came out sluggish and a lot of guys were chasing to get to the handy positions. And uh, uh, it played into my hands because I was able to fold, him, uh, fold in without forcing him. Got a bit lost around the turn and uh, kept him together. Second turn, they all started to come back and I needed to get a move on. And... Uh, 
I had to switch him out. He battled to, to balance up a bit. But once he found his stride, he showed good momentum. And uh, he really done well to quicken up to win the race. You know, he's a big horse. Just well done to Nathan. Sometimes they take a bit of racing to get to lose their condition and to get into peak condition. I had done good, well enough to win. So just well done to Nathan. Mr. Haswell, just uh, thanks for supporting the yard. Now, when he debuted against winners, you were on uh, what looks to be a serious race horse for the weekend. How's your mood about that horse over a mile, Cadence Pride? Uh, Cadence Pride, uh, I really think the race worked out very badly for me. You know, he didn't, he fell out the pins. Being at 1300, I tried to hold my position and I got cut off a couple of times. I tried to regain my position and uh, they eased on him. I had to break his momentum. I tried to shoot down the inside. They all rolled in. So it was a terrible run and I never had a real good rhythm. I know Eden Rock will be our horse to beat, but uh, I, I expect him to be in the first three. Well, I can tell you, Trevor and the boys, they got their outfits ready. They're looking forward yeah. to Saturday. They definitely can. He's a smart horse and I've always thought so. And uh, I think Mao Plus will be a serious horse. One, two, races one and two. That's you. Well played. Thank you very much. I want to say uh, thanks to Nathan. It's one of the best relationships I've had in racing and uh, what a nice time to have his support. Thank you very much. And to his wife, Wendy. I know at home still missing Savannah condolences and uh, wish this could lift her up. And to winning form, thank you. Nice one. Lovely. Muzi Yeni on just for the penny. How about that? 60 to 1. What a pleasure. Alderman Rob Haskell. Well played, sir. 7, 9, 3 and 13 is the way they cross the line race number two. Up next, it's the start of the place accumulator. 13, 10, 10 past 1.